What's up, y'all? So, I just woke up. Well, I didn't just, just wake up, but I've just been thinking this whole, like, morning, just, like, pondering on stuff and, like, reflecting on a whole lot. Like, I didn't even... <laughs> I just came out here like I didn't do my hair no nothing like I'm just surprised that my baby hairs are just like laying the way that they're laying and I I didn't even do anything to them so I, that's that's besides the point <laughs> but I've just been so happy and grateful to the most high because I've just been through so much you know what I'm saying? And like, I've dealt with a lot of like, not good people, a lot of fucked up people. Like people that have like purposely tried to hurt me. You know what I'm saying? Like slandered my name, done shit to me behind my back hurt me or have tried to hurt me, tried to fuck my shit up. You know what I'm saying? Like, I've been through all of that. And through all of that, I have never been alone, ever. <laughs> ever. And it's like, I was surrounded by negative beings and negative people you know what i'm saying like victim mentality people with victim mentality and i'm not gonna lie i I've, I've had victim mentality and like whenever you're around certain people sometimes you take on some of that energy until you take some time out to understand who you are and like what your actual thought processes are and realize that some people really just project their energy onto you and they will you know lie for lie to you or lie about you steal from you to make you seem like you're the fucked up one when in reality they're projecting that energy onto you and then they're running around here like doing whatever the fuck you know what i'm saying like chickens with their head cut off but I wanted to get on here and just give praise to the Most High and to my benevolent angels, ancestors, and spirit guides, my whole spirit team. I don't even know if I'm going to post this, but I'm so grateful and I'm so happy for the people that are in my life and the people that support me. You know what I'm saying? Like, everything that I do. I do it with the most high in the back of my mind and other people in the back of my mind as well. I'm very big on integrity. Very big on it. And I've seen, you know what I'm saying? I've seen miracles happen in other people's lives just by simply praying for them and wanting the best for them. And I'm just like, I'm so grateful that I'm grateful that, you know, the Most High listens to me and is there. You know what I'm saying? Like, I've, the Most High has blessed me so much. Like, I can't even say all the blessings that I've gotten because it's just so immense. But I've also, like, had a lot of heartbreak. And I've seen, like, I've seen, I've seen why certain things were not happening. And it's because certain people were around me. Or like, they were not wishing well on me. Or like, you know, just like jealousy. Just jealous energy. And I can't have that around me anymore. Like, it literally, is, it stagnates me. It stagnates me. And for those of y'all that are empaths or psychics, y'all know what I'm talking about. It's like you have a flow. And then if somebody comes through and their energy is lower than you, like your flow like fucks up you know what i'm saying your flow fucks up and you're like like why like i'm I'm doing everything i'm supposed to be doing like why isn't anything coming in and it's because of the company that you keep so be mindful spirit wants me i guess spirit wants me to relate this message be mindful of the company that you keep 
be mindful of that shit because the company you keep might bring you down it might bring you down i'm not saying it will because because you can never be really brought down unless you allow someone else to bring you down but you can assess the energy you can you can feel out the room you know what i'm saying and you can see what is off and what is not you can understand and see that there's certain people that you bring into your life either they're going to help you increase or they will help you fall and it's like i don't even have to lift a finger anymore i don't i'm so grateful for it like I'm so I'm so grateful and it's like it's literally the first day of Saturn retrograde and here I am talking about this but yes limitations are due to ourselves we limit ourselves by what we think what we consume who we surround ourselves with you know what I'm saying and it's like this Saturn retrograde these next few months till October I just want everybody to be mindful of the things that they are consuming because it's all about karma now karma reaping what you sow you know like you finna start seeing things happen in other people's lives you know what i'm saying good or bad like spirit is not playing with the human race anymore for sure for sure spirit is not playing with the human humans anymore like either you ascend or you die that's 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 what it is you ascend or you die you learn these lessons or you fucking you're out of here move move so somebody else can be in that spot because we're we're rising the earth is rising the whole the collective is rising the the atmosphere the universe all the planets and it's not just earth we're all ascending we're all growing we're all expanding so you either get with the program, grow, program or get the fuck out. You know what I'm saying? And I don't know. I just have realized so much shit, you know. So much shit. And like, I'm just grateful. That's all I can say. Like, I don't even know what else to say about this. The, like, if I could sum up this whole video, it would be that I'm grateful. I'm very grateful. Because lessons... People will go through lessons and not learn them and not learn them. And they'll go through life blaming other people for their mishaps and their misfortune. That's not what this life is about. That's not what this, this is about. Earth is a school. Okay. These lessons that we go through, there's tests, there's tests to them at the end of each lesson. So if you pass the test, you get that blessing. If you pass the test, you get that blessing. I'm just so happy. I'm so I'm grateful. Like, yes, there's sometimes things that like it can be stressful. But at the end of the day, at the end of the day, spirit always comes through and lets me know I'm not alone and that I can get through anything. And that 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 is the biggest i heard <laughs> it's not i don't want to say it's the biggest flex but that's what i heard but it's no flexing on here y'all if y'all been following on me following me on here y'all know i'm not about the flexing and the flaunting and all that shit that's bullshit you know what i'm saying like i'm not here for the for the money for the i'm not here for all that shit i'm here for the most high and I'm here to help those in need, not the greed, the ones in greed. You know what I'm saying? No, that's, that's not what I'm here for. I'm not here for that. People that have known me and that I've left their lives, they know the type of energy that I come with. They know the type of energy that I come with. And once I leave, that energy leaves with me. They can no longer siphon my shit people like i've prayed for people i've wanted so much good for people and those things have happened you know what i'm saying and it's just like but it's been certain situations where i've done this for people but 
they're wishing the opposite on me or they're not trying to help me in that type of way help me elevate either and it's like no nah, i had to i had to realize that you know maybe i am people pleasing you know what i'm saying like and i just realized that you know i had avoidant personality disorder you know and so it's like i was attracting these narcissistic people and narcissists and avoidance they go very well together because narcissists love getting their ego stroked. They love that shit. They love to feel, you know, wanted and needed. And they love attention. And, you know, it just, it just is what it is. You know what I'm saying? I've grown and I'm healing from that shit. And spirit is just like, ugh, I can't even express I can't even express with words how happy and grateful that I am to the most high, to my to my spirit team. I can't even express it in, in words. I only show I can only show them indeed. As, as I can only show them indeed by the things that I do, by my actions. So my tribe, and that's why I'm happy that my tribe, like, my tribe is only, it's not a shit ton of people because I keep it real on here, all right? My channel and what I do is only for people that actually want to learn and grow and ascend and heal. That's it. So I'm not here for, you know, massive clout, you know, I'm not trying to get money out of people. Hell no. I give free readings. <laughs> I give free readings. For years, I was not making money doing tarot. And I didn't give a fuck because I knew for a fact there was a point where I just wanted to end my shit. And spirit showed me. Spirit brought my first client. <laughs> spirit brought my first fucking client. <laughs> After I, I wanted to. I really wanted to. I just wanted to end it. Spirit brought my first client. Spirit like was like, this is what you're going to do. This is why you're here. <laughs> so, I don't give a fuck what anybody thinks about me or says about me or none of that shit. Because I know what I've been through. And I, I know what I've seen. <laughs> and nothing nobody does or says or nothing like that can hinder or make me second guess myself or spirit or what I believe. Nothing and no one. And I'm grateful for that. And, you know, for me and my tribe, it's only up from here for us. I know y'all don't be wishing bad upon people. Like, and I pray for y'all every single night. So just know, like, just know that I love y'all. And yeah, that's really all I wanted to talk about on here because... I've just been crying all morning and just realizing shit. And I'm just grateful. I'm just very happy and I'm very grateful. So, yeah, I love y'all so much. And just know that and feel that. All right. And, yeah, I will um, I'll talk to y'all later.